An undersea volcanic eruption was observed off the South Pacific island of Tonga on Saturday. Tsunami waves were soon after recorded in areas of the Pacific. The Japan Meteorological Agency says the eruption occurred at the Hunga Tonga Hunga Hapai underwater volcano shortly after 0400 UTC. Images from the Himawari Weather Observation Satellite show smoke from the volcano spread in a concentric manner and had covered an area of about 200 kilometers in dia diameter about one hour later. Officials at the Wellington Volcanic Ash Advisory Center in New Zealand says the cloud of ash reached a height of about 15,000 meters. The Pacific Tsunami Warning Center says tsunami waves measuring about 80 centimeters were observed in the capital of Tonga and about 60 centimeters in the capital of American Samoa. Tsunami warnings were issued across wide areas of the South Pacific. Australia has also urged local residents in the southeastern coastal areas to be cautious. The U.S. tsunami warning system initially said a magnitude 7.6 earthquake had been recorded in Tonga at 0640 UTC on Saturday, but it was later downgraded. And we have breaking news. The Associated Press reports that the Pacific nation of Tonga has issued a tsunami warning after an undersea volcanic eruption. The U.S. Tsunami Warning Center says a magnitude 7.6 earthquake was recorded at UTC 0640 on Saturday. AP says a tsunami warning has been put into force across the island nation. Tsunami waves can cause major damage. People in the region are advised to move away from coastal areas and listen to local authorities for information and instructions. And once again, we have breaking news. The Associated Press reports that the Pacific nation of Tonga has issued a tsunami warning after an undersea volcanic eruption. The U.S. Tsunami Warning Center says a magnitude 7.6 earthquake was recorded at UTC 0640 on Saturday. AP says a tsunami warning has been put into force across the island nation. Tsunami waves can cause major damage. People in the region are advised to move away from coastal areas and listen to local authorities for information and instructions.